Do me like some money, guys. Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> oh, it feels so weird. I haven't said this in a while. I hope you guys are well. I hope you guys are good. It's a Saturday afternoon, and we woke up to a cloudy and rainy Joburg. I actually don't mind this kind of weather. Like, people that know me know, like, this kind of weather is, is my vibe. Anyway, we'll take it on one day at a time and one video at a time one month at a time and it, things take time right so that's from standard beauty yo truth is this thing is done but sis will use up all her money because <laughs> yo guys skincare products are pricey but i think it's a great investment and I think just finding something that works for you, understanding what your concerns are and buying the appropriate products, researching different brands, you know, you won't get it right the first time. So that's what I've been doing. I've been using like almost like the same products for over a year. Yeah, I think for over a year now. Um, and I think I'm ready now to like switch switch them up and upgrade my skincare products. So this is for, well it says all skin types, um, evens out skin tone, brightens pigmentation. So I've got a very, very basic, very basic skincare uh, routine for now. So I'll cleanse my skin. Currently I'm using the CeraVe Foaming Gel Cleanser. Um, and then I use the alpha uh, the alpha abitum the niacinamide and my moisturizer and sunscreen i'm gonna go in with the uh, mattifying gel moisturizer with azale azalic acid it's for acne prone and oily skin this has really been a game changer in my skincare uh, routines going like with a few pounds i don't follow like a lot of rules guys like the only important rules that I follow when it comes to skincare because who knows their skin better than you do right so the only thing I don't do is like mix products that are not meant to be mixed like actives that are not meant to be mixed with other actives so that's that's one thing that I don't do but everything else I I just do what I gotta do do whatever I can do I love this I love this moisturizer you I love it this is the sunscreen that I use is the Dermapel Dermopel Dermopel I think moisturizing sunscreen SPF 30 it's a broad spectrum um, sunscreen UVA and UVB blocker anti-aging anti-pigmentation fragrance free sunscreen I like this it's it's very very moisturizing rising sunscreen provides maximum sun protection helps prevent blemishes and premature skin aging so this is great and I know you guys know it if you don't know about when one thing finishes and everything else and there's still quite a lot in here wait So this is two fingers or three depending and this is what I do you know just try not to put I'm not gonna lie it stings your eyes uh, so try and not play around or play too close to your eyes guys I'm not gonna lie it really does thing and going on your neck as well and your ears and just keep my hair in it just keep massaging it into your skin until it's fully absorbed sunscreen does to you guys the sunscreen ha <laughs> believe the hype believe the hype and that's about it obviously other people have other stuff that they do post this there. for me that's that i love it i love it glazed donuts i just had to do my hair <laughs> so i then i've been looking for like a flexible tripod 
because I had one which was like a random purchase from Take A Lot excuse me from Take A Lot like in 2020 yeah 2020 it was great I uh, like the fact that it had a remote control however I found that my camera and my phone are a bit heavy on it so it doesn't hold quite well Ooh. my lips are so dry I'm talking and I'm like mm -mm. My lips are so dry, extremely dry. <laughs> and I then stumbled upon this off the macro website. I hope you guys can see. There you go. I like the fact that okay, it's good for your cell phone. It works for your it's for action cameras, uh, like your GoPros, and it's also good for like your your mirrorless DSLR cameras. So that is great. And. Okay, the package includes a flexible tripod, which is the actual tripod. Um, it's got a phone mount adapter. It's got a remote controller. Uh, that's a bonus. That's a plus. <laughs> and an action camera adapter. So this is great. I really do hope that I will enjoy it. So let's see. Okay, so there's the adapter. There's the remote control. Or controller <laughs> so this works both for cameras and phones phones both ios and android and ta -da! i've been wanting this it feels so steady i'm not gonna lie it feels so steady this is so nice this is so nice let me move back a bit this is so nice it's so nice. It's got a very, very steady grip. I'm not gonna lie. It feels really, really good. You can actually twist up the legs, do whatever it is you want. Oh, this is cool. I like it. I like it. Ooh. Okay. So yeah, this is so cool. Um, I'll definitely let you guys know if I encounter any problems, but so far, I'm happy with what I see. I actually forgot to mention, um, I have to have to mention this. I was thoroughly impressed with the delivery of this um, tripod. Tell you that I was receiving constant updates on the order via SMS, via email, and I received this in two days. I received this in two days so shout out to macro and I'm not mad about the other item coming <laughs> after this one because I, I honestly understand I just forgot how much this was but I will check I think it was 298 if I'm not mistaken but I'll check and let you guys know much later no later for real <laughs> <laughs> so we got lens shading at four and yeah like you know if, if you get load shading from four onward like it's literally like a bummer like a huge huge bummer i know like load shading is is an inconvenience but like from four onward i guys yo so anyway we just accompanied my husband to get his hair cut and then we i don't know <laughs> I think we're just gonna browse around the mall and see what's happening like what's happening so sorry guys like i'm in the car with my daughter so when i see people like like literally staring into our souls like i become very uneasy so the area i'm in it's not dodgy or no it's not dingy but it's got a hint of dodginess so yeah and 
I actually decided that I'm going to stop saying, please excuse my crustiness because I think 90% of the time I am looking crusty. No lies detected. So, hey guys, this is just me. I'm, I'm chilled, I'm laid back. So I hope you guys will get used to seeing me like this. And if I do put on a face and I'm looking all snazzy, let it be like an occasion, you know? Because like putting on makeup is such a task and taking it off, <sighs> nah. I, it used to be me, thank COVID, that I'm over the whole living your life in makeup life. No, I'm enjoying my base skin. I've been taking good care of it. Um, yeah, no, man. I just literally put on sweatpants, a sweater, and sneakers, and that's that because, I mean, we're not really going to do anything special or anything out of this world so that's that and we were like really in a rush you know so then hmm, let me tell you a story of my life like with my ages man i put on gel <laughs> it probably doesn't even show now like i'm so like i don't know like i think my ages i just i just stubborn and that's that i should accept it and i am trying to you know nurture my i'm trying to nurture my hairline because Honestly, I will not blame anyone for anything. I've been braiding my hair for literally 14 years or so. Uh, don't give my hair a break. I'm not going to lie. So I take full responsibility of that. I literally... It's only like a recent, like this year, where sometimes I give myself a week or two off. If I'm really, really being intentional. But to be honest with you, my hair used to be washed at the hair salon because I was lazy. I thought like there's nothing better than having like flat laid hair and although my hair is natural like I know it's just a, a bad relationship that I had with my hair better care of my hair like learn how to wash my own hair buy products relevant products for my hair so I'm still learning I haven't been to the hair salon to, I haven't been to the hair salon in two years which is great um, but braids are killing my hairline braids are effing up my hairline like you guys my hairline i it's i'll try and find a picture if i have i don't know if i have but i will try there's this show my josie hairstyle i love that hairstyle right because braids i also like a bit of a lot of work because you need to sit hours getting your hair braided and it takes long to and get it undone so sometimes i just switch it up by you know trying different like protective styles and that hairstyle is dope like i really really love it that hairstyle hey i'll find a picture and i'll try and put it somewhere here so i'm still trying i'm trying to find products that can at least like stimulate regrowth or something like just help me with my hairline because like <laughs> It is so sad. Um, there's a lot of dodgy guys loitering around here, so I'll check you guys later.
this smells really really nice my goodness
Queenie. Hey guys, uh, welcome to a new day. It's a Sunday. <laughs> I feel so betrayed by this weather, guys. I feel so, so betrayed. Like, um, as I was reviewing some of the footage that I captured yesterday, I realized that I didn't actually say goodbye to you guys in a decent and respectful manner. So, that's basically what I'm here to do. Also, like, I woke up this morning and I knew that I had plans to go out and do stuff, right? Sorry guys, I realized that my mic wasn't plugged in and I didn't want to distort the sound. So anyway, I woke up this morning knowing that I had plans to go out, run a few errands and stuff. So I thought I would actually take you guys along, capture whatever it is that I was going to do. Then I, we woke up to rain, like it literally rained the entire day. So I feel so betrayed because like at around 4 o'clock, did the sky not open up? Did it not clear? Did we not have sun? Like like you know so i just thought man you know what um, let me just come on here and close the vlog properly and don't be shy to share my channel with your friends and family so you can help me reach more people and obviously grow the family i think that's it for now guys i know it's not much um but i just thought you know what let me just try and put something decent together and not have like a dry spell for more than a week and i don't know when you guys will be watching this but thank you so much for watching thus far guys if you haven't subscribed please once again do consider subscribing and thank you so much for giving me a chance thank you for your precious time and your love and support check you guys later